Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you all are doing fine. So just like last year, Wondershare released another major upgrade for Filmora this December, Filmora version 12. But many people were hesitant to try a new version and were wondering if they can keep both versions of Filmora on their PC. But whenever they try to install two Filmora, it asks them to uninstall old copy first. So in today's video, I am going to show you how you can install multiple versions of Filmora side by side. If you are new to my channel and would like to see more videos about Filmora, then make sure to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon to stay updated. So let's get to the video. But before that, let me tell you two things about this method. Number one, you can only install multiple versions of Filmora with this method and run them one by one. But you can't run them side by side like different versions at the same time. You can do this with different method and if you are interested in that, then let me know in the comments and I will make video of it. Number 2, it will use same directories for files and all other things, so you will be logged on to one account in both versions of Filmora. Now this is clear, so let's start the video. First of all, you need full installer of Filmora you need. You can install first one from Wondershare site, but for second one you need full installer file. You can ask Filmora support for full installer link or comment down in my video and I will be happy to provide you with link. With both files downloaded, first install version you would like to try. In this case Filmora version 12. After finishing the setup, close Filmora if it opens. Now right click on Filmora software shortcut on your desktop and click open file location. And then rename the parent folder to something different from default. And that's it, now you can easily install second version from installer file. Now to run first version of Filmora, just make sure that shortcut is pointing to the same directory that we renamed it to earlier. That's it, if you have any question, feel free to ask in comment and I will reply as soon as possible. If you like this video, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe my channel. Just wants to give you a heads up that you can edit files saved in older Filmora versions in Filmora 12 but you can't edit Filmora 12 file in older versions of Filmora. 